All right, as I was saying, this is totally pointless. I might do this all over again on a different recording device because who really wants to watch 10 minute intervals of me editing something? Maybe I'll redo it. I'll just upload this and then redo it later. Forgot to fix it. Stop. I wasn't being recorded right now. I'm really singing to this song that you cannot hear. Fair warning. Mm. This needs to be curved. Why is it pointy? Don't know. Don't know. Don't ask me questions. I'll take it really matters if it's bigger than it already is, huh? Ah. Gosh darn it. Don't want that. smaller brush. There we go. No, that's not where we go. Golly gosh darn it, I can't make it look the way I wanted to. I told you. I have no idea what I'm doing at the time. And this song got really loud for no apparent reason. Don't worry, I fixed it. And now my foot's asleep. Uh, the problems of somebody who has no life. I'll beat my game and not my game gimp in about five seconds. This is annoying. That back there needs to be black too. So it looks like it's going over the shoulder, you know. And now my song got really quiet, okay. Because I can't hear it at all at this point in time. Um, I feel like I should fast forward through me doing this because, let me tell you, it's really boring. Me trying to figure out how to do things correctly. I just want that side to be curvy. Why is there so much to ask for? Dang it, now I have to do the entire thing. Oh, there we go. There we go. I can't do that right there, though. Golly gosh darn it. Exactly what I wanted to do, but you know, whatever. Trust me, you're gonna tell me this is the most pointless thing in the entire world. You'll understand. Five, ten seconds. Oh, oops, wrong button. Okay, to do this outside the. Oh, bug. Um, to do this outside of the circle to mess with things outside, so you can't, you can't, you can't. You mess things up in the middle, but you can't. Alright, you right click. And you go down to select and click that button and then there you go. Look 
make life became just twice as easier. Ta-da! Oh, I didn't get all the pieces. Alright, there we go. And then you go select that button again, and then not like that. I swear it makes it look nice. Alright, ta da! Stop it. Oh, that took me long enough. Oh, Jesus. See, look, you can see that. It is totally pointless, trust me, you'll understand. I keep telling you that. This is why I don't do this for every, every one, like every type of picture I do, because this takes forever. Alright. Oh no, I missed a spot still. Ah no, go back, go back, go back. Alright, there we go. There we go. Haha, -ha, see, look at that, oh, that looks nice. Nice. Nice indeed. Now if this was like a full body picture and you had clipping, I'd usually do the same thing like that. So it doesn't look nearly as bad and use the cloning thingy, which I will show you how to use in a little bit. If you didn't know how to use that already. And you just you fix things. I fix pointy edges because those bug me. Sometimes, sometimes I'm lazy and I don't. Stop it. There you go. I know that one part's slightly lumpy, but... Actually, I don't have to show you how to use the cloning thingy because there's no place for me to use it. The cloning button is uh, this stamp looking button and I use it to fix hair when it's messy or like in a part where it doesn't need to be and you want to cover it up you press the control button which took me forever and three days to figure that one out by myself press the control button down and then you click on it and then you can just clone hair now yeah sometimes that doesn't really work but you just clone. I can make her have more hair if I so desire, cause, see, see, there you go. So she doesn't need it, that's how you use the cloning button, if you didn't know that one. It comes in handy, especially when, fli when fixing clipping problems, that one helps a lot too. Now what I mean by harsh shadow is that underneath the chins every time these nice long big black shadows underneath them and it drives me nuts and it's always better to go up and down rather than sideways because you're just gonna mess some things up alright and usually under the lip too I always get rid of those but on the skin it doesn't I don't know why I d it might just be the skin or no because I use the same it is, it's just the skin that doesn't have the really dark ones, because every other sim I have, they always do. And then, on the eyes, I usually do the eyes last, because they're slightly more difficult to do, is that I smooth out the, the eyelid, because that drives me nuts too, because that's pointy. And don't worry about messing up the eyelashes, I'm going to show you how to fix that in a moment, though. You're going to want to 
go over to your layers button if you do not have the layers button over here go to click on this little arrow that says configure this tab 